After the number 2 comes the number 3. Resident Evil 2 has set a prime example on how to manage and create a remake for an older video game, but the remake for the third one is a different beast. For some unknown reason, Resident Evil 3 looks better and also runs better than the Resident Evil 2. Yeah, interesting. But even though it is running better, it does not mean that there are no people that are seeking a little bit of assistance to make the Resident Evil 3 run even better on their system. Today, I'll be showing you how to improve the performance of a Resident Evil 3 remake. This is not a typical benchmark video that will show you what it's like to play the game on certain hardware. This is a video that will show you what it's like to improve the performance of the game on certain hardware. Before we proceed with the optimization process, uh, you will need to head over to my website and uh, download the installation package for the low specs experience. The download link is located in the description of this video. Low Specs Experience is a game optimization tool that I developed uh, that will allow you to optimize your favorite games for maximum performance. Now start the installation process for the Low Specs Experience. Once it's done, uh, start it from our desktop shortcut and uh, head over to the optimization catalog section. From this drop down menu select uh, Resident Evil 3 and then uh, press uh, load optimization package. Now if the Low Specs Experience does not automatically detect the game version, Simply choose the installation directory where your game has been installed, press OK and the optimization control panel will load. When the optimization control panel loads, uh, simply select the method of optimization and resolution you would like to run your game on. This is something you will need to experiment on your own in order to see what works for a system the best. Once you decide which optimization method and resolution you are going to use, press the execute optimization button and then uh, start your game. Also, if you are not satisfied with what you see, simply choose the Restore Default option, which will restore your game to default settings. That's all from me for now. If you like what I do, please be sure to like the video and subscribe to the channel for more similar content. Anyway, I'll see you all next time. Carlos, I've reached the main avenue. Which way do I go? See a big transmission tower? That's the substation. You'll have to circle around through an alley to your right to get there. You mean the alley that's on fire? Maybe. Surely a tall drink of water like yourself can put out a few flames. Fuck you. Gotta put this out. 